Greenland is a country where we have a lot to look at. We have a beautiful nature, we have beautiful people, we have beautiful music, and you have to tell people about Greenland in pictures. Today we are in Greenland, just north of the Arctic Circle. We're going to check out some villages, we're going to do some whale safari hunts, and of course we're going to see a whole mess of icebergs. Many people here doesn't actually see the beauty as you do. The, the, uh, we only have mostly respect for the eyes and not the beauty. That's why, because the eyes is a mostly obstacle for many people. You, you lost the beauty of the thing. There's no beauty anymore because just uh, it's in the way. Oh, wow. oh, oh, There's so much ice coming out of, of the, in, uh, of the, the uh, ice fjord, it becomes an obstacle for many fishermen because the ice is unstoppable. Even with the big, biggest icebergs in the world, you can't go in to the, to the ice fjord. The, the, the glacier is producing double as much as for about seven years ago. For about seven years ago, the glacier produces about 20 million tons of ice per day. Today, it produces a double and about 40 million tons of ice per day. 15 years ago, in the winter, people here went out with their dog sleds and the sleds out to get the fish to go hunting. And this is Today, the dog doesn't have any really significant uh, status. It's not so important to have dogs anymore. The fishermen are noticing the fish is getting smaller and smaller. That means uh, they can see they're overfishing. The halibut, which they are fishing out there now, it's getting smaller. and likely to disappear in about 10 years. And they have asked for quota for the government uh, to, that everybody should have a, uh, some uh, a, a limited kilos to catch a year. But the government doesn't really listen to that yet. So it's, it's, you don't see it in uh, many places in the world that fishermen themselves want quota and the government really doesn't really listen. Every 20 years, we get a polar bear here in this area. For about a month ago, there was a cup, polar bear cup, big enough to, well, to walk around here in this area. And we never see any polar bears. But because it doesn't really have any choice, it comes to land and uh, will try to live in this coastal lands. But it creates a danger that pe people, it cannot be too close to people. So it had to be shot. <laughs> 